Hello and welcome back to our channel. I am Farwa and you're watching Ninja Iraqi Dinar News on YouTube. I hope you all are doing well. Today, we have some exciting updates on Iraq's infrastructure and its impact on the economy. So let's get started. Iraq is currently rocking and rolling on its infrastructure projects. This development will not only create numerous job opportunities, but also open up the economy for Iraq. It's an exciting time, and let's hope nothing spoils this progress. Now, if you only have a small amount of dinars and want to exchange them, what should you do? Well, the best option would be to visit your bank manager. If you have 100,000 or even a quarter of a million dinars, simply go up to the teller and ask them to assist you. You might be moved to a different counter, specially designed for this purpose. Have you ever wondered why countries hold foreign reserves? These reserves act as a backup fund in case a country's national currency rapidly devalues or becomes worthless. It's a common practice for central banks globally to hold large amounts of foreign exchange reserves, primarily in U.S. dollars, as it is the most traded currency in the world. The amount of reserves a country holds affects its currency rate, and here's an interesting fact Iraq currently holds the largest foreign currency reserves in its history. This indicates their readiness to revalue their currency, but there are still some necessary steps to be taken. Iraq's focus now is on combating corruption, as recent news suggests. For instance, al Halbusi, the former Iraqi president, is now facing four criminal charges paving the way for a cleaner financial system. Iraqi banks are also making progress in straightening their accounts with other countries. Next week, they are starting a currency swap with the UAE using dirhams. This is a necessary step for Iraq to conduct business with the UAE, just like their ongoing efforts with India. However, it's important to note that although these currency swaps are happening, it will take some time at least until the end of the year to see significant results as the implementation process needs to be carefully ironed out. So when can we expect real results? By the end of the first quarter of 2024, we should start seeing some tangible outcomes. It's an exciting journey for Iraq, and we will continue to keep you updated on any further developments. That's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching Ninja Iraqi Dinar News. If you enjoyed this update, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. Until next time, take care and stay tuned.